What's up, everybody? Welcome, welcome to the stream. How's it going? I don't even have my headset on. Headphones on. Uh, hello. Happy Friday. <sighs> welcome on in. Welcome back to Yes Tomorrow. This is uh, Yes Tomorrow Part 3 slash Island 3. So we're going to be slip sliding around here uh, for a little bit. The goal of this video is to just get through the island like the other two videos have been. That's been like... Like, that's been the goal of the other two videos. Uh, so, that's the goal of this video. I believe there will be a part four. Um, maybe depending on how long this takes, that'll kind of dictate. Pardon me. Dictate exactly what uh, what happens. But, uh, I have fixed my connection issue. Hopefully this won't disconnect. It's now wired a wired connection um hopefully that'll that'll work better because <clears throat> last part two of that is just annoying annoying with the number of times that it crashed and had to reset and all that stuff so <sighs> welcome on in hopefully i hope everybody had a good holiday um i believe we are in Correct island. It does have a little bit of trouble. Um, I can't go this way. Whoops. Oh. Okay. Uh, that. That. And then that. Okay. Alright. Seemed to be having some minor problems with my Elgato capture card the other day. So hopefully hopefully everything's okay, but I don't know. Hopefully there aren't any terribly important issues. Oh okay. Now that should be giving me an achievement. I'm like 95% towards one of the achievements. We have a new thing. Let's see. Uh, so we saw almost everything on the desert island except for this one. The ice island though. Snowball beetle. It's blue. It's fast. It rolls towards you and leaves a dangerous trail in its wake. This tough beetle is the major cause of avalanches on ice island as it likes to roll downhill as fast as possible. Legend says if you crack open its shell, if you crack open the shell of a snowball beetle, you're sure to find a blue hedgehog inside. However, no one seems to remember how and where this story originated. They they have put in Sonic in this game. Sonic, Sonic in here. Ow. What? What did we unlock? Ice, ice basin beetle. Whilst the ice basin beetle is physically is is physically strongest of all, uh, intriguingly, it is also the least aggressive. This docile beetle, native to the ice island, is a friendly fellow and doesn't mind the presence of others, but get to male ice. Ice masons together, and you can be sure they'll engage in a fierce battle for territory. These moments are rare, however, and the ice mason, as its name suggests, is mostly seen marking its territory by freezing water and humid air to create ice blocks formed into a frozen nest of sorts. What? Oh, oh, okay. Alright, I gotcha. I see what's happening here. Whoops, 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 whoops. OK. 
Okay, so we have a hermit crab queen that we can learn about. Hermit crab queen. Ice island hermit crabs live in strictly organized matriarchal families. A family usually consists of one female which lays eggs and is well equipped to protect her nest if needed. They have a distinct red color and a large sting on top of their shell. Females are aggressively protective over their young crabs and do not... Uh, or... or Females are aggressively protective of their young crabs that do not yet possess a shell and, as such, are vulnerable to uh, predators. Icy Cove's Fortified Village. I should probably go to the village first. Can you just slide down this? What? Whee! Ah, an Everlight Barrier. Not all is lost yet. Who goes there? I am Yui of the Forest Island. Drop the shield. We've got a survivor. Are you sure? Absolutely, sir. Ain't shadow activity in sight? No shadow activity, sir. It says any, by the way. Oper dropping shield. Tell me the survivor. Tell the survivor to meet me. You're free to pass. Yui of Forest Island. Hurry up to the palace roof. The chief wants to talk to you. Okay, hold on. Hang on. We're gonna pop a pop that spicy save. go in any of these areas <gasps> we can pet this dog though there's a cube here what does this do in here all right I'm sure we'll have to go back in time is this okay I was gonna say this is not clearly not the right way Pet this dog. And let's see if the achievement... I don't think the achievements have fixed themselves. So 23 of 44. Which means that we should be 23 out of 30. And if you take 22... 23? 23, hang on. I had to pull up a calculator here. 23 divided by 30. It should be 70... 76, 77%. Something like that. It's 83 that's weird. Okay. 23. Tormentor banished. What the hell is happening? There should be one that's like 95%. Pet all complete, complete, complete. Cleanse 150. Banish. No. Hmm. Yeah, there's one that... Oh, God. Did I unlock it? Banish 100 shadows. Pet 20 animals. Banish 20 with the dash. Wait, this one was sitting at 95% for like... Alright, whatever. 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 Alright, so we're 23 of 44... We're at least making progress on the, the petted animals here. Meow. 
Look at all the cats. Look at all the cats we get to pet. <gasps> So does that count as four? Yeah, that absolutely counted as four. <laughs> wow, okay. So we should be able to get the 30 at least. I, I won't be able to get all of them because I've definitely missed some here and there. Worth it. Go check all the go check all the areas you can. And we'll just go up here. We gotta go up top anyway. Ooh. charge already hello father oh we found him real quick oh shit Yui but you but I would he have a heart attack what the fuck father are you alright Yui is it really you I can't believe it I just don't understand. I saw them destroy the chamber. I thought you were... dead? And yet, I thought the same about you. But how did you survive the attack? Forest Guardian protected me, and I eventually found a way home. Forest Guardian? THE Forest Guardian? I think so. Why? Sir, we need to shield back up fast. A wave of shadows is approaching. The shield, of course. Father, watch out. Curses. I said shit. Yes, that is a curse. Huh. This is very bad. Without the crystal, I won't be able to amplify my shield for the whole place. Palace. Warriors, the crystal has been stolen. Everyone, follow the emergency plan. Stay in your high nuts until I get the crystal back. I fought hard to keep the crystal away from shadows. I'll not let them have it that easily. Yui, I see the, that the Forest Guardian bestowed some of its power upon you. I will need your help to get the crystal back. Oh, cool. You didn't bother to look for me, but now you need my help. I'm not sure what shadows plan to do with it, so here's the plan. We'll split up. I'll hurry to close the portals and cut the shadows from the uh, for, for more reinforcements. You'll follow the Raven King to the Temple of Meditation. That's where it nests. There used to be a cave system leading from the village to the temple. Try looking for it. Steal the crystal from the Raven by uh, from the Raven King by any means necessary. And Yui, do you know uh, if your mother and Haro are? They're safe, Father. Don't worry. By Everlight, there's still hope. I'm so glad you're alive, dear. Back. Hurry to the temple. Oops. 
New map fragment. Sweet. Can learn about the game. Mystery. Oh, there's like six of these. Okay, so. Fortified village. <clears throat> Towering above the majestic fjords and hills of the, I of, ice of the ice island is the majestic glacier. An imposing natural fortress of ice and stone. On its peak rests a relatively small temple of great importance. It holds the access to other worlds in the multiverse. There are two options to access the temple. First is the almost vertical glacial wall, the main route of ice children. A tough and exhausting route even for the most skilled timekeepers, and outright impossible for a commoner. The other, more time-consuming option is to circle around the mountain and ascend the glacier from the abolition area. Abolition area? Area? As the sun disappeared after the invasion, the glacier froze over even more, blocking off many paths leading up to the temple. Okay, so three, six. And then there's, so there's this last central island. Uh, that'll probably be like the f a final, like part four. Ah. Speaking of the scrolls. The third island was meticulously carved in the ice by the Ancient of Protection and Ka and contemplation. Its beautiful but rugged landscape can be witnessed from afar as the island is lined with fjords that provide refuge to those brave enough to venture further. The island mountains are interwoven by a maze of ice caverns sculpted by the water currents that flow into large glimmering lakes. Towering above, you uh, find Monumental Glacier, which holds special portals to other worlds at its peak. So since this is here, I'm guessing that I just go into the past. Several years into the past, game saved. Excellent. Definitely gonna go talk to this dude. Greetings, little lady. What brings you to the timekeeper? I'm Yui of Forest Island, and I seek a path to the Temple of Meditation. So young and so keen, I was I was like you when I was your age. The temple you seek lies west. Follow the path through the caves outside of the village. Thank you, timekeeper. But be careful. The path is quite dangerous. I will be extra cautious. Thank you. All right. So I'm assuming that these doors just kind of... I guess you can't do that there. Oops. Okay. So we gotta go west. Uh, oh, also, did be. Ooh, one more pet from thirty whole gamer score. Woo. All the kitties are gone from here. Or maybe this wasn't the area. Snowball fight, you want to join? I threw a... Boys, dinner's ready. There's an achievement for... Throwing a bomb at an NPC, which I have done tons of times. Oh, come on. Come on, game. Give me that. Sit, Foxy. Sit. Do you have nothing to say? Alright. That's fine. I heard that the forest island collects small fish and puts them in a glass tank. We do do that. Oh, look at this sweet color palette. Give me a pet to pet. 
I need it. I want it. Do you think kids on Desert Island also build snowmen, but with sand? Sandmen? And what do forest kids build? Mudmen? Haha. <laughs> We're the ice cutters. We slice ice and nice dice. Oh, we're the ice cutters. We slice the ice into nice dice. Whew, boy, that is hard to say. We save the nicest. Oh, I don't need you to point your saw at me, sir. We save the nicest ice blocks for ourselves to make statues. Look at this fish. It's got a sword on its head. We sell fresh fish every day. Good for you. Give a man a fish and you'll feed him for a day. Teach a man to fish and you'll feed him for a lifetime or whatever. Garbaggio people like to say. Alright, let's see. I've gone down here. Already petted that dog. Oh, this is the house of all the cats. Look at you, my man. You're living the dream, dude. Remember, Yui, you can never have enough cats in your life. True that. You know what I mean? Just 100%, man. Uh, we're guarding the gate so no wild animals get inside. Never, there's not really ever anything useful in these houses. No, like, items or anything. Wait, was there something over here? I thought there was a Y. Nah. Okay, now we can head west. Um, hello? Um, hello? Where do I have to go? There's no other way to... There's no other way to go. Oh, okay, that's right. Never mind. Ouch, ouch. Fucking chill. Ooh. Is this correct? It looks different, but it also kind of looks the same, because I... Okay, now we're good. We're good. Temple of Meditation. Okay. Ah. Oh, that's going to be super exciting. Nope! I saw it too late. Okay, whoop. Fragment unlocked. 
Learn about the icy caves. Oops. Beyond the fjords and forests lies a frigid and barren yet strangely serene mountain range of rock, snow, and ice. Frozen, meandering uh, streams carve yeah, carve through and below the jagged rocks, twisting like crystal snakes, creating a path for potential travelers. There are even some resting points along the way, adorned with large rune, rune stone carvings honoring ice children and providing refuge for pilgrims. However, one has to be well prepared to face the icy caverns as it's easy to make a wrong turn or get lost in these tunnels. Those who make it out uh, on the other side those who make it out on the other side of the mountains are deemed worthy of becoming the portal guardians. After the invasion, some of the cavern system collapsed while other corridors froze over completely. The passage is, is considered impassable by survivors. All right. Ouch. Damn it. Oh my god. This sucks. Stop. Stop. What? Is this nonsense? get these to come down. Oops. Hmm. There's nothing over there. Okay, that's okay, that's okay. This way. Okay. At least it's leaving stuff lit up. How do I? All right. So. I don't know. How do I get this fucking stuff down? I can't go up there. Ugh. Okay. There's nothing over here. I don't believe there's anything really to do up there. That's fine. Let's go check that out. There also may not be a... Okay, there is. Um... So we'll just we'll go all the way back up to the top. God dang it. I just don't think there's any other way 
two go. Alright, that's fine. That's fine. You know what, since you don't take any damage. And there's nowhere to go up here. I have to get to that. But what I'm what I'm not understanding is how I get these <clears throat> big chunks to fall on the ground. Do I get them to fall on the ground? One, two, dash. Hmm. Yeah, I use the god damn it, I use the double jump. Yeah. How do I get up there though? So do I have to Hmm. Mm, there's something I'm missing, and I don't like that I'm missing it. I feel like for the most part, this game's been like pretty well tutorialized. There have been a couple of times where it's been like, well, didn't really explain that. But for the most part, it's been pretty good about telling you what you need to know. I don't know why I'm doing this, I'll be honest. I have to get up. Yeah, there's... <laughs> so I have a bomb. I have a roll. I can't... I can't get to that level without a double jump and because of the way you have to do that you kind of you burn your double jump immediately god damn it and you don't you don't dash into it doesn't seem like there's anything to do with the bomb i also can't get this fucking timing down Uh, I don't have any other things to do. I have a dash, I have a roll, I have the light thing. I, what the fuck? Hmm. Okay, alright, alright game. There's nothing I can do over there, because that's covered in spikes. That jump was a little short. Hang on. I'm gonna go ahead and damage boost. There's just thorns all the way up there. Okay. How do you. How? What the. What am I fucking missing? I'm gonna be so annoyed when I look this up. Well, this isn't helpful. Remember, look how it says it says yes tomorrow. Game, yes tomorrow. Alright. God damn it! I'm so annoyed. So where's this? Where's this go? Am I in the right timeline? What's going on here? Oh my god. 
This is so unhelpful. Okay, this looks like it this looks like it's early. So we haven't even gotten to the Wait, what the fuck is that? What is hat? What is this? Am I in the wrong freaking timeline? Is that the problem? Is that the issue? Is I'm. Just Are you fucking serious? Are you fucking serious? God damn it. That's fine. It's fine. Okay. One. Jump. Am I really in the wrong? Why would they put that there if you didn't need to use it? So we'll go all the way up here. Okay. Uh, Sean, stop. You're getting irritated. I can I can see it. I can sense it. I can fucking feel it. God damn it. I guess that would explain why these jumps were a little tricky in the initial part. Get out of here. Yeah. What? This. God damn it. God damn it. here yeah the old way what the fuck so you kept going down this way so then you went why are you futzing around in this area I think that's what's confusing me is you're like this, honestly, this is not a good walkthrough. Are you serious? What in the fuck are you doing? So this person that I'm watching is over here trying to jump on the thing that the beetle is throwing. Now they're down by the dog. Hurry to the temple of meditation, but you have to be in the past. Oh my God. This is so annoying. All I need to know is just how to get the fucking things down. So this video is like an hour long. 
They spent a good chunk of time doing this over and over and over again. No. There's n there's no way that's the answer. Are you serious? That's the fucking answer? Oh, god damn it. You you're you're pooping on me right now. You're shitting me. You're sh that's that's not right. That can't possibly be right. That doesn't make any sense. Why would it be so specific? is so you're telling me that in order to progress I have to jump on that little I, I don't think that's right. I genuinely don't think that that is correct. That doesn't make any sense. It's, it's too specific. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Oh, God damn it. I hate this. I'm so annoyed. All right. I would, I'd have to do that in... No, because this game's good about transitioning you between times when it's necessary. And why would they... There's, There has not been a point yet in this game where... Uh, uh, where the game has not... Or the game has given you a... A... a, a time change thing and it's not been necessary or required there's there, no 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 ah, I can't I can't I can't I don't want to do that here's I don't want to do it for two reasons one it's way too specific and I don't like the platforming element of it but two and more importantly the cycles are entirely too long Pardon me. And again, the game has never given you a reason not to change to change the timeline. Like you still go to the icy caves, right? There's a save point here. This is gone. This is different. Well, at least we're back here again. And you can also point out in the comments that this video is blah 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 long. Yeah, Temple of Meditation. So maybe that's the trick. Ah, there it is. Oops. 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 There it is. Oh my god. I knew it was going to be simple, and I did forget that I had that power. Ouch. Fuck. Alright. Okay. See? Alright. Alright. Alright.
And it, it makes sense from the other perspective of uh, if you're in the future, um, those would likely be fallen down, whereas in the past, these are all still the same fucking problem, okay. Whereas in the past, they would be up. So, like, I, I get that. But, okay. So now what? I'm just kind of here. Are you serious? There we go. Please stop. Again, just trying to get there. But if I call this down. Can I even leave this area is the question. I don't know why this area all of a sudden has confused me so much. Nothing there. Nothing there. nothing up here. We have that enemy up top. That's the where we're working towards. Great. This game is very dark and I, there is not a brightness setting. We unlocked a bestiary for the hermit crab. Hermit crab worker. Uh, a crab queen usually has multiple male workers at her, at her disposal, whose main job it is, whose main job is to scour every nook and cranny and search for a viable shell for their newborns. Male workers are not aggressive, and their leg grip is so strong that they can climb a wall with an adult human mounted on the back of their shells. Just don't mega stomp them while you're being carried, or they'll shake you off. Oh shit. All right. You're cool. We're cool. It's all good. Okay, 
so that should affect the future. I don't think I've ever watched a walkthrough, a walkthrough video that's been that misleading before. Like just, like just not even close. I don't know what the hell they were doing. Maybe that's a shortcut to speed run. Speed run technique. There's gotta be a pet up there somewhere. Right? Maybe not. Maybe not. I do have enough hearts to go down here, you jump. Different path. Oops. Right. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's good. It's cool. Alright, several years into the past. Boost me up? No? Alright, that's fine. That's fine. I didn't want to go any higher anyway. It's cool. It's cool. We're good. We're good. Yeah. Definitely, that definitely has the uh, the sonic spin to it, which I didn't really like. I didn't put together. Seven to forty-four. The achievement's all busted and wonky and weird. All right. Uh, ice horn beetle. While ice masons create and use blocks uh, of ice as a defense against their enemies, ice horns, on the other hand, take a more aggressive stance. By slamming their nose horn against snow, they are able to summon an icy wave of sharp shards, impaling whatever comes their way. The shrapnel beetle. This beetle lives uh, by saying. Or lives, lives by saying that when you can't aim, go for the burst. When it perceives danger, it panics, hides in a shell, and boom, spreads its surroundings with sharp fragments. And then the ice frog. According to legend, a desert trader named uh, Tenang Dalishan 
brought uh, had brought a shipment of frogs from the forest islanders to sell to them as a delicacy to inhabitants of Ice Island. His journey became oh, his journey came to a bitter end when his ship was caught in a storm and wrecked by the sharp rocks just off the coast of Ice Island. As the shipment washed ashore, surviving frogs swarmed the beach and spread across the island. Over the time, they have adapted to the harsh winter life, even settling around the frozen lakes. Cool. Alright. is up. Okay. Whew. Barely made that one. Alright. Dealing with a whole lot going on here. Cliff ahead, that's fine. There's something in this area, okay. Alright. <clears throat> Frozen lakes. All of the caves led to a large and surprisingly green mountain valley. Great sapphire lakes stretch through the middle and above it towers a simple and inspiring temple of meditation. There used to be an old bridge leading from the cave exit directly to the temple but has since uh, fallen apart as humans were unable to transport the resources required to repair it through the cave tunnels. Thus travelers must make their way through the valley. Despite the relatively pleasant climate and the abundance of fresh water, the valley remains largely uninhabited, mostly due to a very or due to its very difficult access. Frequent avalanches and no connection with the coastline. Oh, I'm sorry, I read that very weird. Due to its very difficult access, frequent avalanches and no connection with the coastline. However, the valley has its animal inhabitants. A swarm of ravens nests in the valley and on the surrounding cliffs. The ravens have a strict hierarchy, ruled by a large intelligent raven known as Raven King. Legends say he can even speak human language. After the invasion, the valley withered and, and ravens, corrupted by shadows, took over the neighboring temple. Now they act as spies for their shadow overlords, scanning the islands and looking for animals to corrupt and people to kidnap. RIP. Fucking god shot over here. Nope, nope, nope. Just as long as you avoid that, we're good, we're good. We're good, everybody's good, we're all good, we're all good, we're all good, we're all good. Hello? Stop. Please stop. Ah, shit. The kitty. We're going back. We're going back for the cat. Going for the back for the cat, ladies and gentlemen. Meow. Whatever. It popped 30 gamer score. Or 50 gamer score. I'll take it. I'll take it all day long. Don't shoot me in the butt. 50 gamer score. 207-662. Oh, that's my camera is right over the top of that, isn't it? No, it's not. Just kidding. God damn it. Okay, absolutely was hitting the wrong button. 
definitely not opposed to it in regular form. Okay, so we have the cat. Let's have the cat is happy with us. We saved them. We pet them. We made them feel good. I don't know why I'm doing this. It needs to be done. Give me some that I don't honestly don't need. That's okay. Those resources have not been as uncommon as I thought they would be. I have had maximum for the most part. Again, there's not been, okay, yeah, and always make sure that you have what you need. I don't know why I was so shit, so shit at that last part, you know what I mean? Okay, here we go, going back into the past. I have to go all the frickin' way around, huh? Yeah, I guess you won't let me do that. Um, alright. I am very far away from where I was. Oh god damn it, what are you mm, to zip? Oh okay. Cool. So I have to figure out how to get rid of that. Sweet. Very excited about it. So that does that. And that does that. And then this. Whoops. Okay. Fudge. Um. So, okay. So let's go back. God damn it. Several years into the future. Several years into the future, those things aren't a problem. Yeah, 
looks like they're all gone. Are they? Wait, hold on. How do I... Can I go... Can I go? Can I go? Can I go? Hmm. Does this have something to do with it? That doesn't make sense why that would affect the past. Alright, so let's see if there's something we can do. Can we go back down that way? No, we cannot. Fine, we're just gonna make our way down here. Oh, this is still here. get rid of it. Hmm. Yeah, these are still here. Oh shit, what up? what up wolf or dog? We're good. <gasps> Kitty. Whoop, whoop. I have a little leftover frustration from the earlier part. I just wasn't getting what I was supposed to be doing. But since I can go down here, actually. Can we go... something to, something that that does okay ma'am miss please can I get to you oh I sure can all right I'm I'm overthinking a little bit. I'm like now I'm kind of stuck in this area, which is cool. a little bit. Skip that step, huh? Is 
soundtrack is very good. This feels like it's going to be irritating. Okay, whatever. Whatever. As long as, long as it's on the damn... Alright, alright, alright. You want to fucking chill? Can't wait for it to come back down. Progress. Whee. Okay. okay. So now what? I sure hope I don't have to put it on one of those. Oh no, I don't. Okay. Whew. Whew. Ow. Ow. I need to push it all the way around. Come on. Come on. Oops. Oops. Little kitty has heart over its eye or over its head. Oh, I guess, yeah, I guess this is in the past, so. Alright, just wait for one more cycle to go through. Push, 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 push. There we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I've pushed it too far. Shit. Shit. Alright, well, we're going down, and we're going back up. Push it right, right to the edge this time. God, it would have sucked if I would have pushed it left and then been like, well, guess we can do this all over again. All of that so that I can do this. Oh, gee, thanks, game. Cliff ahead. Uh, I should probably go back and save that other thing. Save, save, save. Yeah. That way we're just... We're in a much better position. Should something go wrong? There's almost always, like, solid save points once you go, like, right inside a big door. This was no exception. All right. Go over here just a little bit. Whoops. Whoops. Maybe 
that was all that's up here. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. That's all there was in this area. It's fine. Um, hello? How <laughs> do I get out of here? Oh. This door. This door, don't worry, we're good. We're good, we got it, we got it. Okay. And that is as far as we get to go with her. We'll switch into the future, because that'll... Oh, just kidding. Fucking shit. Alright. Okay. Let's just see if we can get through that other area. We're good. It's perfectly fine. I think we'll have to switch back to the smaller. <clears throat> God damn it. One, two, three, four. I still struggle with the freaking wall grasping in this game. Jump, double jump. So one, two, two, ugh. one, two. God damn it! Just get me over the. Light. It's like okay. One, two. Oh fuck off. Okay. Ah. Dash. Oh shit! Hi, how are you? Holy hell. Did I get them? How many do I have? I have seven? Oop. Oop. Okay. That's alright. Who dodge roll? Dash. Um, hello. All right.
Oh, so there's something else I need to grab in that other area. Didn't leave myself in the best position after that first run. But that's okay. This is gonna fucking suck. That's okay. Stick with it. Get there eventually. The good news is, is that it gets easier because if you knock the you knock the things out once, it doesn't like. Whoop! Boom! There we go. Sean, you are a dumb person. I can't believe you jumped that early. Hello, stop jumping on the wall, please. For the love of God. Okay, you can jump late. I jumped, I jumped so early. Like, just wasn't even close early. Whoa. Hit on the top. Did it again! You fucking impatient motherfucker. Stop. The timing needs to be later, later in this run. Bam. So there we go. This one. Just a nice double jump. This other one, also, just a nice double jump. There we go. Throw in the dash when need be. I jumped way too early on that. Ouch. Hello? Okay, well. Got, got through it. Whew. All right, so I need to do the two on the left side. Cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky. Oops. Yep. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah. Boy, oh 
for. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Fuck. 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 Fucking. Fucking. Fuck. Oh my god. All right. Well, that was insanely lucky. I'm just so bad at the timing stuff. Like. Oh, goodness gracious. All right. So we have another fragment here. Or artifact. Artifact? Is that what this is? No fragment on... Well... We have, might have both. The uncorrupted children didn't notice that there was something wrong until it was too late. It is unknown what sparked the first rebellion, but a full-scale conflict known as the Never War was soon to follow. When they realized what was going on, they still felt deeply for their taint, uh, tainted brethren and didn't want to kill them. In a last desperate attempt to stop this senseless war, they con conducted a ritual. They would merge with the Dark Children and try to defeat the shadows, <clears throat> shadows, excuse me, plaguing their minds. Their plan backfired instantly as the merge turned into. I'm sorry, as the merge turned both battling children to stone. This, however, thwarted the shadows' plan as well, since the bulk of their armies were now imprisoned inside the petrified children. Three children, one from each island, were ordered not to take part in the ritual in case something went wrong. And I believe we have a map piece to read as well. The Temple of Meditation itself. Many ice children uh, admired the secrecy of the village. Guarding the portals was a demanding and uh, was demanding was a demanding and tedious work, so ice children sought out a peaceful atmosphere whenever they felt sad, angry, or overburdened by negative thoughts. Eventually, piece by piece, uh, they constructed a humble temple on a cliff overlooking the valley. Not long afterward, investigative desert children uh, found out about the temple and spread the word around the world. In the following years, children from all islands visited this location and helped build a beautiful temple. Desert children raised two high towers on its sides, while forest children reinforced the main dome and built additional meditation and practice rooms. It remains a holy site for ice islanders, and each islander tends to make a pilgrimage to this temple at least once in his or her lifetime. Alright, so... Missed a couple here, a couple here, and we have... Two left in this area, and then the main island. But we haven't even... Uh, taking care of... God fucking damn it. Why? Why? I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so fucking much. I hate it. You fucking goddamn bastards. Fuck, I hate the mechanics of this. I just, it's so annoying. God fucking damn it. You know what? Fuck it. Just, just take the, that didn't even work. Fucking bullshit. No, no.
I hate the wall. I hate the fucking wall jump mechanics so fucking much. I hate them. I can't fucking stand them. God, they suck. Okay, just, I just want, I just want, I want on top. Oh my god. Oh my god, just get the fuck off the wall. God damn it. Oh, that's so annoying. Okay, why can't I do that? It's so dark, I didn't realize there was another thing that needed to be done. I was even commenting, oh, these aren't hard to find. It's weird that they're in such an abundance. Oops. Oops, did that incorrectly. So what I need to do is hold, then let go. I don't want to miss anything over here. Okay, please. Okay. So, definitely need to be in the dark timeline, or the future timeline. Let's see what the trial is. I'm sure it'll drive me insane. Okay, why? Why would you grab onto that? A few hearts. Hope it took a little. Uh, hello? Now what? Now what? Now what? Oh, god damn it, now what? Do I just drop back? I don't even know. Oh. All the way down here. Weird. Oh, I guess it's not all the way down. Okay. See, the thing that sucks is when you get hit off of these, it it just drops you. There's like no. So can I just drop? Nope. You sure can't. Don't 
just drop blindly. No big deal. Couldn't possibly... Oh, yikes. Got fucking baited there. Um... All right, hold on. Jesus. Holy shit. Hold. Hold, 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 hold. God damn it. God damn it, god damn it, god damn it, god damn it. Oh, I was right there. Kind of. All right. Do I need to go... I must need to go all the way up. I dashed right into that. God damn it. God damn it, game. God damn it, game. Fuck. Fuck you. That's so annoying. Don't worry, we'll grab onto every little fucking latch that we can get. Yeah, you must have to go all the way around up to where the dog is. I just didn't realize that that's where that was. down there is just spikes. That's fine. Alright. All the way down there is just spikes. Hmm. That's inconvenient. New collectible entry unlocked. Antique silver thing. This one is uh, rather a curiosity. This shovel once belonged to one of the most notoriously famous portal defenders, the Shovel Guy. It's got to be a reference to Mystery Men. He was an ice islander who made a living by maintaining the ice uh, cavern road leading to the village of the Temple of Meditation. When he was little, his beloved father died while uh, the caverns w died in the caverns while making his pilgrimage to the temple. It was a great loss for the boy, and he dedicated his life to keeping the precarious path safe for future pilgrims. He grew up to be a strong and tough fellow with people praising him for his good work. One day, he decided to undergo the pass the pilgrimage himself. As he passed the caves and stared, descending down to the valley, as he stared, descending down to the valley, he saw a great avalanche coming down upon a small, unsuspecting settlement. With his shovel in hand, he raced down the slopes and started digging for the survivors. He searched tirelessly for almost a full day until he rescued a woman and her two boys. As luck would have it, these were the wife and kids of the t ice timekeeper himself who, upon hearing the story, promoted the hero to portal defender. Nobody would have thought, but his shovel skills proved to be very useful in portal defense. From, um, from digging hideouts, shortcuts, staircases, to even becoming an outstanding fighter, slapping shadows to oblivion with a simple shovel. The shovel was getting worn out, however, one day, and it simply broke. When the Ice Timekeeper heard the news, he collected the broken pieces and brought them to the Forest Timekeeper Robin, who masterfully repaired and imbued the shovel with Everlight properties. From that day onward, Shovel Guy became the terror of Shadow Invaders. He's the shoveler. It's the shoveler. This is a game that is clearly... Uh, so how am I doing this? 
this? How do I get to you? Paparino? Whoa, 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 chill. Chill, chill, chill. Go. Up this way, down this way, maybe? Nope. Nothing here. Nothing here at all. Uh. Oops. Jumped, uh. Dimma double jump too. Dip jump. Jib jump too early. this. Ouch. Take these. Give me nine. Well, actually. All right. Well, good. just went ahead and took that away from myself, huh? So... Oops. All right, well, it doesn't matter. I'm not gonna get all the pets anyway, so. Oh, my Lanta, you dingus. You, god damn it. I hate this. Nope, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. So, uh, so now what? Let's uh let's take a let's take a quick break. Okay. All right, welcome back. Sorry. Harder hard to hard to focus when you have to pee. Okay. Go this way. Bam, 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 bam. You fucking suck. on top of that. Good. Alright. Alright. So. 
Ah. Oops. No, you fuck. You stupid fuck. God damn it. God damn you. Sure love that when you get hit, you drop all the fucking way. Just don't get hit, forehead. Save it. We could save it. We could save it. We could save it. We could save it. I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna fucking scream. Please stop. Please, please stop. Please stop with this annoyance. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? I can't even... God fucking... Alright. 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 Ass hat. My worst enemy is timing-based platforming. <laughs> okay, maybe it's not my worst enemy, but it's it's definitely up there. I seem to manage to be able to do the timing-based platforming, it's just on the wrong time. This doesn't do anything. All right, here we go. Yo, what up, crow? Platforming this? Is that what we're working with here? Ouch. Okay. Whoops, 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 whoops. Okay, that's fine. is doing anything. Oop. <sighs> All right. I have to get through this part first. Before it even like, does really anything. Alright. 
God damn it. Ah, fucking damn it. Okay, alright. Figuring this aspect a bit out. What else do I... Oh, I wonder... Oh, shit. Alright. Explains why the platforming has been so... Oops. Okay, we're figuring this out. No big deal. Hmm. Okay, alright, alright, alright. That's fine. If I die this time, at least I know what I'm doing. One. Two. Okay. Mm. Ooh, shit. Up. That's alright, that's alright, that's alright, that's alright. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I at least know what's happening now. How dare you? Yep, that fuck you. God damn it. Ah, oh, this is really fucking annoying. Stop hitting me. So twice on that. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. So then here, should get the one. Should get two. Mm, there we go. No! No! Stop shooting me with your fucking stupid talons! Jump and grab the fucking thing! What are you doing? You stupid bastard. Fucking fuck. What garbage? What fucking garbage? And the reason I the specific reason that I think oops. Uh, I don't know. The reason I think that one was garbage. I was slamming on the up to get on the Oops. jumped into it oops cool excellent big fan of big fan of that huh stop fuck off fuck off fuck off So far! Oh, god damn you. I hate you. I hate you. I hate you so much. You shit fuckface raven. question is, do I just let it do the fucking... Come on. Do your the fucking stupid little talon thing. Alright. Cool. Great. That's fine. Whoop, you bitch! You fucking... You stupid bitch. Why, why land on the platform I can slam my fucking head into the goddamn concrete? You dumb... Bastard. 
it is infuriating to me that you have to push up to get on the net. God fucking damn it. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I didn't want to beat this anyway. So, you stupid bitch. You stupid fucking bitch. Cool. Cool. Excellent. Great. Fantastic. I lost all of God damn it. Fuck you. I don't even know what I hit. I don't even know what I fucking hit. I really don't like this. And the weird thing is, is this one and the, uh... God damn it. This one and that dragon were, like, are weirdly difficult. And they're, like, the mid-bosses, I'm assuming. Please. There. Just do that. Oops. That was my fault. I should have seen it coming. Definitely need to be. Whoops. I ended up taking damage from what I was. God damn it. God fucking damn it. I hate this. I fucking hate this. It is. It's everything that I don't like all combined into one thing. Here's timing-based platforming and somewhat poor control schemes all at once. Enjoy. God damn it. We're okay. God fuck you so fucking hard. I took so much goddamn damage. You fucking piece of shit. Go to hell. There's no way I'm going to make it all the way back up. You have to make it so fucking far. And it's... Ah. <laughs> I don't God damn you. If I beat the cycle, and I get you onto this fucking level, don't shoot your little fucking bullshit at me. Fuck you. I even tried to go slower. He just, it just keeps going. It just goes no matter what. Cool. Excellent, excellent. Super. One. I'm so happy. I'm so fucking thrilled with this goddamn fucking boss battle that has nothing to do with actually beating the boss. Oh, what's that? Hello? What? That was weird. Why do you damage to a boss when you can do platforming? You know what I mean? Dodge! Dodge! Dodge. Dodge. No! Hot fuck you. I 
hate you, you stupid raven bitch. So irritating. Don't shoot, don't shoot, don't shoot. The thing that's so, so annoying is that it's hard to... Okay, dodge that. Okay, alright. Bastard! Fuck her! Fuck you in the mouth, you stupid fucking bitch. I did the, literally the same thing twice in a row. <sighs> Fuck it. Just kill me. Just kill me. Just let's restart this. Yep, there we go. piece of shit. Cool. Great. Excellent. Excellent. Love having to do that when the attack is going off. And I took the hit anyway. Sweet. God damn you. Fuck you. Get out of this section not too terribly. Thankfully, there is. Jump! Jump! God damn it! You fucking piece of shit. I hate you. Good. I will lose my shit. Thank fucking Christ. Oh, the mist is lifted and the curse of the black curse is gone. You freed me, human. How can I repay this deed? I came here for the crystal you stole, Raven. Can you give it back? Alas, I'm afraid I can't. The crystal is no longer in my possession. Shadows clouded my thoughts, and I brought the crystal straight, straight to them. They needed it to summon their most powerful aviator. Oh, great. If they complete the ritual, our world will stay flooded with shadows forever. Darnation, where, was, where is the ritual, and how do we stop it? Come help me, uh, come to me, my brothers. Your king needs your help.
This human freed me, brothers. Take her to the throne roost. I wish to reward this human for her help. There is an Everlight Altar at the Roost. Use it to your advantage, human. My brothers will show you the way to the portals. And hurry, time is of the essence. Okay. So hard to drink out of cans and headphones. Run to the Temple of Reflection and prevent the summoning of the Shadow General. Heart piece collected. Need one more. Bonk. Press X to freeze time. This ability uh, freezes everything in place for three seconds, except Everlight abilities. Recharges after six seconds. Use it to freeze enemies or moving platforms. No. What? Achievement, move! Oh, for the love of God. Gotcha. I am going to hate this. So you do that. You jump here. Okay. So can you just... Jump here. Jump here. Jump here. Glacial wall. That's kind of silly. spot. Yay. Cool. I sure love when that happens. Oh. Okay. What's weird is that they don't qualify as platforms when they're in motion, but they do when they are frozen. But I do like the tutorialization. This apparently is just death. You fucking springy bitch. Whoops. Okay. Whoops. 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 Helps if I'm just if I'm not dumb. That's... All right, 
right, all right, all right, all right. Uh, who the fuck are you? And why do I not want anything to do with you? Hello? Oh, so you still count for damage. Okay, hold on. I'm just going to go over here and save the game real quick. Come back here. Come back here. How dare you. Okay, alright. Alright, everybody. Alright. You are. Uh, hello? No, 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 no. Go fuck yourself. Go f absolutely go fuck yourself. Oops. All right. Okay. All right. I don't know what this is, but I'm scared. I'm so scared. How, how am I alive? How am I alive? Jesus fucking Christ. Are you serious? I fucking, I hate this. I hate this so fucking much. Okay. How do I get rid of you? Hello? Don't, you fucking shithole controller. Oh. Pretty sure the game broke on me. Sweet. Feels cool. That's all I want. I just want this shit. Oops. Well, that's not gonna work. Nope. Ugh. Oh, you are a stupid, 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 stupid man. 
Go fucking fuck yourself, you fucking bitch. Get the fuck away from me. Please, nope, just, yep, there we go. Fuck out of my life. Wait, wait, what? Oh shit, ouch. So that would makes more sense what you would need to jump on that thing. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if I really should try the trial. So it's it's a double jump and dash. Nope. I jumped a smidge too early. I hate this. I don't know why I decided to do this. Please stop jumping off the wall. Please stop. All I'm trying to do is jump up. I hate this so much. An extra heart piece could be. My favorite part is when it doesn't even fucking qualify. All I want you to do is do just fucking double jump, you stupid asshole. Okay. 
Boop. Okay. You fucking bitch. the trial, I don't care. Okay, all right, all right. Fucking ice. What am I doing wrong here? You're a fucking bitch. Oh, wait, hold on. Make sure that I have full. Make sure I have it full. Okay. Mm, you piece of shit. Fucking piece of shit. the raven. Ravens are iconic to Ice Island, although their nesting point is the valley below the glacier. They can be frequently seen on all three islands. They are very intelligent and cautious with a strict hierarchy that organizes their flock. An old legend says they are ruled by King Raven, but nobody has ever seen him, except for the timekeepers, perhaps. The Raven King. Ravens are considered to be the most intelligent birds in all of Yestermont. They have nests on all islands, but... The largest colony is situ uh, situated on Ice Island. Pardon me, they have never been hostile, but they wouldn't be considered friendly. Humans and ravens have always had something of a mutual, something of a mutually suspicion and cautiousness uh, of one another. Humans consider ravens to be arrogant at best and capricious at worst. Ravens, on the other hand, see humans as inept and disorganized when compared to their strict hierarchy in which every member has a precise role from the lowly pro to the Raven King. Long ago, long ago, one particular species of the Raven began growing to disproportionate sizes. They would become the leaders of the flock known today as Raven Kings. They grew not only in physical stature, but in their intellect, developing the ability to speak human language on a basic level. However, due to the utmost respect they held for the hierarchy, a Raven King would only speak directly to a Grand Master Timekeeper. After the invasion, the, Ra the Raven King struck a deal with the Shadows. He offered to be corrupted without any resistance if the Shadows leave all other Ravens alone. The Shadows agreed, knowing that, corrupted or not, the common Ravens would remain loyal to their king. Once the king was under, the control under their control, so was their flock. Okay. 
a grabber, very similar to Groom, Gloom, excuse me, but only more aggressive. The grabber's strategy is to uh, go perfectly flat on attack and and attack an unsuspecting victim from below. Its consistency is similar to Tar, so getting it uh, getting out of its grasp can be a bit of a struggle. We also have the Evil Eye, lost on the physical sludge type, or last of the physical quote-unquote sludge type are the evil eyes. These shadows are basically red, glowing red orbs of concentrated hatred, all coated in a thick layer of black ooze. Every orb, very similar to the human eye, shoots a shadow of bolts in the direction of any sign of Everlight. However, the orbs are also very vulnerable once you use Everlight to get past the slime. So, contrary to all the other shadows, evil eyes try to keep their dis distance. Shadow Fiend Shadow fiends are spawned by corrupting intelligent creatures such as human beings that they take the longest to develop since humans possess free will and can resist the influence of shadows on their minds for a long time. For this reason, shadows often kidnap humans and lock them up in dungeons and torture chambers where their will is more easily broken. Once spawned, shadow fiends are almost as intelligent as a human being. Though they lack the ability to talk, they will try to dodge your attacks. I didn't mean to do that. So we can learn about the Shadow Horror. Horrors are the most vile of all common shadows. Their appearance alone strikes terror in the hearts of humans, not to mention their preferred attack, where they teleport behind unsuspecting prey, snatch it with tentacles, and devour. It is assumed that horrors are created by corrupting portal defenders and apprentice timekeepers. Fortunately, horrors are never seen outside the temples or other important shadow garrisons, since they are deemed too valuable to be sent out. Uh, oops. Since they are deemed too too valuable to be sent out to corrupt lowly wildlife. The shadow tormentor. Oh, we learned about that earlier. Okay. Almost all of that done. We learned anything more here? Perchance? Oh, we have. We have, we have. The Glacial Wall. Unlike its desert sibling, just looking at the rugged cost, or coast of the ice island tells sailors they're in for some rough times. Yet again, unlike its desert sibling, once you navigate through the icebergs and cross the ominous cliffs, the island rewards you with harsh but vibrant nature and plenty of game and fish. Its beautiful but rug rugged landscapes can be witnessed from afar. Uh, as the island lined with fjords followed by the stalwart snow-peaked mountains. The local village sitting at the foot of these mountains is a place bustling with sailors, traders, monks, and warriors. It's a fortified settlement built around an old monastery where recruits from all islands train to become por portal defenders. The second most respected role after timekeepers. Ice villagers are uh, reserved, but thoughtful and friendly. They are used to living in uh, scarcity and prefer to keep it that way, as opposed to inter enterprising desert islanders. Shadows knew that strong and disciplined ice islanders possessed the greatest threat to their invasion. Therefore, they try to distract them and slip past their defenses straight to the desert island. Although their plan worked, shadows were unable to completely conquer the ice island since. Thanks to your father, they managed to protect the a large Everlight crystal. We just have the Temple of Reflection. That's the last area that we would need to get, and then there's three in the next one. Oh, shit. Yui, thank Everlight you made it. Father, what happened here? As I ran uh, to the portals, I noticed that the shadow activity was unusually strong. I distracted some of them, sneaked past the rest, and when I reached the portals, I saw a terrible thing. Shadows already have the crystal, and they're using it to summon their general. Even worse, they are corrupting the Ice Guardian to be the vessel uh, for the vessel to be their leader. Infuriated, I attacked the swarming shadows. It was a bold but futile attempt. 
I caused some serious damage to their ritual, but I was soon overwhelmed and barely managed to, to escape. I I failed. There's too many of them. We can't possibly disrupt the summoning this time, or in time. It's over. I'm sorry. Something tells me that this is uh, time is. Something tells me time is not an issue if you can freeze it. Come on, Dad. Let's show them what we're made of. My injuries would only slow you down. I'll join you once you reach the portals. Danger. Cliff ahead. You never know what could be out there. Could have put a little animal for you to pet or something. Lost a heart somewhere. Whoops, whoops, whoops. It's fine since we can get rid of a lot of this down here. I think I accidentally went the right way. I'm not a hundred percent sure. Oops. Hello. Can you stop? Why are you running so slow? What is going on? Can you not do that? What is happening? Why? Why are you doing this? Alright. Okay, that's more what I was looking for. Ooh, we unlocked scroll entry number nine. The ancient protection knew that the survival of Yestermaro depended on the safety of the portal. Therefore, when it created the Ice Children, it focused on discipline, hardiness, and unyielding will. Although other children viewed their Ice Brethren as a bit of an enigma, no one ever questioned their determination and self-control. They were masters of martial arts, vigilant, perceptive, and always prepared to defend their homeworld. Life in cold seclusion, combined with centuries of religious training and self-improvement, had an interesting side effect. It proved that the Ice Children, with the ability to reflect on their actions and wisdom, and the wisdom to formulate, formulate numer numerous life philosophies, most of which were collected and archived by the Desert Children. Oops. Please stop doing that. Just double jump. Nope. Double jump here. Nope. Jump on the chain. Pause. Annihilate. Go down here. Hit Y. And check your achievement progress. Uh, nothing. Alright, cool. Alright. Now I'm moving at the correct speed. this whoops hello whoops whoops whoops, whoops.
Oops. Oops. No, please. 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 Stupid. Fucking. Fuck. Why, 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 why are you here? Why are you here? Did I get enough death last time? Alright, well. Okay. Nope! Damn it, that is a fucking nightmare. Jesus. The checkpoint is really far away. There's so many of you. Fuck you. Fuck all of you. Why? Don't do that. Don't grip onto the fucking wall, you idiot. Just, just, don't jump off the wall. Just double jump and dash. You fucking ass. Thank you. Learned about the Temple of Reflection. This one, this is a whole map that we completed. The most populous ice children were the shield bearers, stationed deep inside the glacier. These unyielding warriors would protect their home from anyone will wanting to enter with ill intent. Uh, with the help of other children, the portal chambers were carved into a mirror hall, bending light and darkness to confuse the enemy and giving ch the children the upper hand. The improvements did not stop there, however, and soon enough a temple of reflection was built around the temple or around the mirror hall. Seeing the many reflections, children themselves became competitive or contemplative and questioned their own values and perceptions as well as their place in the world. But being consistently confronted with the shadow attacks on one hand, 
but being consistently confronted with shadow attacks on one hand and existential questions on the other eventually led to the downfall of the children, uh, the Never War. What human defenders lacked in size, they made up for in numbers. Each time shadows attacked through the portals, humans drew, uh, would draw Everlight strength from a guardian statue situated just below the portals. This strategy worked until one day the sun stopped coming out. When Everlight ceased to flow in the world, their power granted by the guardian recently diminished. Power granted by the guardian recently greatly diminished. The defenders, now facing unfavorable odds, decided to take the Temple Crystal into the village and protect it at all costs. On their way to the village, they crossed paths with a, f with a forest timekeeper, rushing up to close the portals. Understanding the situation, he joined them in order to protect their village and hopefully wait for reinforcements from other islands. Oh, please. Oh my fucking god. What hell is that? <laughs> oh my god. Must resist darkness. I'm gonna get my face fucking my teeth goddamn kicked in. A defender? Quickly destroy the crystal. Lol. There's gotta be you you have to put a checkpoint in here somewhere, right? Look at how fucking long this is. Oh dear Jesus God in heaven. Excellent. Just in case you weren't under enough stress. Can you... Can you... Thank you. Oh. My. Fucking. God. Okay. Okay. God damn it. The game is also really struggling from a frame rate perspective. I've noticed because it is loading so much. Hello.
You fucking... You stupid goddamn fucking bitch. What the fuck, you fuck? God damn it. That was just... Nope, it did the same thing that time. Nope, 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 get out of the way! Wait, no, 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 no. Are you serious? Are you serious? Fuck you. Nope. Why did you bounce me that way? Hello? I'm, I'm, god damn it. The ones that spawn in behind you are giving me the most trouble right now. No, no, fuck! I can't, I'm having trouble with that second dash up there. If some of these, if I could get some of these enemies out, I wouldn't have such a problem, but they keep showing up behind me. That's bouncing me. Just get me up here. Nope, I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong fucking button. I meant to pause time, but I dashed. Fuck you. Thankfully, there's a checkpoint here. Oops. I saw it spawn in, and I thought I would make it. Please. 
No. You can just do this. Again. Hitting the wrong button. Just missed the jump. Just missed the jump. Ooh, boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. This is what I was afraid of. When I was talking about this in the my like early impressions when I had it on the on weekend review, this was what I was concerned with. But it was going to hit a point of like man, this is getting rough. No, just, 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 just kindly fuck off. Fuck all the way off. Nope. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Bam. We, we weren't good. We're good. Just get... God, those, they are the worst. Okay, I really don't need this cinematic every single fucking time. Really don't. I get it. There's fucking annoying things chasing me that makes this already stressful sequence even more fucking stressful. Thank you. I figured it out. That's the irritation speaking. Oh, cool. The health aspect, thankfully, has not been the concern that I thought it would be. Um, it's been more just the precision aspect of it. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're gonna just do this, and we're gonna do this, and we're gonna do this, and we're gonna do this, and then we're gonna jump. Nope. I don't know what to do. Fuck me. Fuck me. Just fuck me. <laughs> I'm sure it has to do, I'm sure it's something with a bomb. I did not realize that I was that close. So when that showed up. You fucking absolute moron. Probably need to be using the time pausing more consistently. Except for there. Nope. Nope. 
Nope. Nope. Nope. I'm hitting all the wrong buttons. I'm driving myself nuts. Fuck you. If I could just get those motherfuckers out of the goddamn way, I'd be fine. I hate this. Oops. That wasn't my fault. I was pushing up on the fucking control stick. And it just she just didn't grab on. Sometimes the game does that as well. Where clearly I went through the goddamn thing. I missed it again. I missed it again. For no fucking reason. You piece of fucking shit. Fuck you. You've got to be kidding me. If you're going to make precision platforming, make it fucking work. Jesus Christ. It's been a consistent problem since they introduced that fucking mechanic, god damn you. Right through, down, right through. Up, up, off. I believe what you have to do is you have to jump right to left and then I think you can hit it. Uh, but I do definitely need to make sure that I have a bomb ready to roll in that particular sequence. Oops. Well, I fucked this up. God damn it. Uh, thank you, Captain Kobe, for the eight months. Oops. Oops. Stop. There we go. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you for being right where I needed to be. Sean, for the love of God, please stop mashing buttons.
Read the message. It says farts. Message. Message says farts. Everybody. Definitely forgot about the bomb situation in there. Nope, you fucking little asswad. Just go up. Jesus Christ. I feel like I'm thinking about it too much. Need to follow the flow of the game. Hello? Oh, just take me, just fucking take me, god damn it. That second, second little wind tunnel is giving me a surprising amount of trouble. Hello? Okay, alright, you can just, you can absolutely just fuck all the way off. Did it wrong. Did it wrong. Hello? <sighs> Fucking, I, I hate when this happens. I was making it through, making it pretty far, and then I've just all of a sudden just shit the fucking bed. Jump on the fucking platform, please. 
I think they've also just despawned the enemies. They're like, clearly this person sucks. gonna destroy a controller god damn you you fucking piece of shit I hate those chains oops Feels like a really annoying Mario Maker level where you're like, ah, I got through, got through most of it, and then all of a sudden it's just been a cluster. Through that, down, through that, up, 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 off, pause, around, down. Okay, don't forget about the bomb. Pause that for a second. No. Whoop. Mississippi 2, Mississippi 3, Mississippi 4, Mississippi... Okay, you have four seconds before it goes off. Ugh. Fuck this. This is so annoying.
Thank fucking god. In all my existence, I have never seen such an act of bravery and self-sacrifice. Young Defender, you have dealt a great blow to the armies of darkness. The dead, or this deed will not be forgotten. Girl, you have done the impossible. You survived the invasion, learned to weave Everlight and save the world from the shadow, uh, uh, shadow invasion. This surpasses even my wildest dreams. <clears throat> but there is one more thing left to do. We must try to fix the conduit. This chamber, as you probably know by now, leads to the Tower of Time. We had an agreement with other timekeepers to meet here in case anything happens. I couldn't leave our village in the middle of the invasion, so I decided to send you. But ever since the invasion, I haven't heard from uh, any of the people. Huh. I, own, I assume none of them made it out alive. Yui, this is the sixth monolith shard. Combined, these shards should provide enough Everlight to open the tower gate. Ascend the tower and find the conduit. Once you locate it, seek me out. By the turning of the, by turning the conduit back, we will renew the flow of Everlight and save our world. In the meantime, I'll round up the survivors and secure the villages. Villages, yeah. We'll be waiting for your return. Be careful, my girl. Oh, interesting. Didn't realize I was going to get 50 gamer score out of that. Hell yeah. As his voice quakes and breaks. Pardon me for the goddamn fuckery. Oh my god, that was awful. They did thank god they finally despawned those enemies. It's just those those little um wind like kickstart things where you have to dash through them to activate them. Those are so inconsistent sometimes. And it's uh very frustrating. Alright. So we have the three islands done. Okay, so did we go? Is there a place to save? There we go. Whew. Okay. This is uh this has been part three of Yes Tomorrow. Um this last island I don't think is very big. So I don't I think I think we'll be okay. Um let's see. Oh we got this. The Shadow General. Very little is known about this prime shadow. Timekeeper studies suggest that the Shadow General is the highest manifestation of the shadows. Representing their collective deceitful mentality and sheer physical power, the general is channeled into a corrupted worlds, seizing control of the portals to immediate, ultimately seal corruption of the islands forever. No human has ever seen the general, and it is crucial that it stays that way. All right, we'll make sure that that's saved. This has been uh, part number three of Yes Tomorrow. Hopefully, you enjoyed. I know it was probably a little irritating there at the end. Um, but hey, we're getting through it. We did it. We have one last little island to take care of. Um, and I say little because all of these have been very, fairly large. Uh, but this one's quite small. Um, so we'll just, we'll finish this on a uh, different day. Not 100% sure when that's going to be. But, uh, I will definitely, definitely finish this game. Got 490... Banish 20 shadows with Mega Stomp. Oh, cool. 
Uh, beat the final boss. Cool. Complete cleanse. Ding. Throw a bomb at an NPC. I don't know why that won't unlock. Unlock, unlock all map fragments. Collect all the artifacts. A couple more secret ones. And, uh, yeah. Are those, those are probably pretty rare. 2.14, 4.29. Alright. Well, there you have it. Through three islands and, uh, with a fourth on the way. Looks like there may be two more of these, maybe. We missed a few of the artifacts. I'll probably have to go through this game again. Which doesn't sound like what I want to do, honestly. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, um, we'll be back with part four, which will go ahead and finish this game out uh, sometime in the future. I don't know when. Maybe do like a bonus stream with this and something else or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Um, but until then, fuck that platforming. Now that's a negative way to leave it. I like this game. I do. I get irritated with it, but I, I do enjoy it. Thank you for watching. We'll see you uh, last next time.